Hello. Hello. Oh, hi, Tattoo. Oh, Tattoo wants to say hi as well. Okay, go there. Hello and welcome back to my channel. It feels weird to even say welcome back because it's been ages since I've done a video. Um, and let me fix this. It's a little crooked. Literally, the li life has been a whirlwind. It's been a really amazing year. Um, there's so much that I want to talk to y'all about. I'm not going to put it in this video. This is just like a super quick, a super quick video because I'm really excited about this thing. This is not the typical content that I bring, but I'm just so excited about it that I had to bring you in. I had to bring you in because I'll be bringing you along for a lot more now and we have a lot to talk about. And guess how I'm gonna talk about it? Boom! That's right, that's right folks, that's right. Hey, I'm so juiced. It's been years since I've had a new phone. I'm not really the type of person that gets you know, every iPhone that comes out, I just like, I feel like it's a little bit hype beasty. I'm gonna say what I said. I'm gonna say it with my chest as well. It's a little bit hype beasty. Um, and frankly, like, unless my phone is like really not operating well, then I'm like, I'm pretty sure it's fine. So the phone that I'm on right now, the phone that I've had for like the last, I think, three years or so, or something, maybe more, is the iPhone XS Max. Um, I have basically busted the back. <laughs> my pictures are, you know, 2019 quality and everyone else out here with wide angle lenses and all that kind of good stuff and um i just i told myself that i was going to reward myself for setting a goal and hitting the goal and the reward was this bad boy so i actually brought y'all along with me to go to the apple store on regent street to come pick it up so i'm gonna put those clips right here Hello, zero so I told myself that when I completed my master's and submitted my dissertation, my gift to myself was going to be a new phone because um, I've had my phone for like, I think over three years. Um, and I like own it, I paid it all off. I didn't like jump on the newest iPhone every time one came out. And at the same time, I like have really been craving being able to take such better pictures and videos. So I told myself that I would gift myself with a new phone. And I submitted my dissertation on Tuesday. So we're on the way to the Apple store to pick up our new baby. And now for what you're here for, which is the unboxing. Um, we're just gonna go straight into it and just ad lib. First things first, look at how sleek this box is. Like, again, I haven't had a new iPhone since the iPhone XS Max, so maybe all the boxes are this small and I just am new to this. But when, when like the runner from the Apple store brought it out, I was like, why are you bringing a case when I ordered a phone? Where's the rest of it? So I'm genuinely excited to see what's inside the box. The phone that I got, I got the iPhone 13 Pro, um, 256 gigabytes in C, C blue? C, is it C blue? Sierra blue, Sierra blue. Um, so I just, un, I just, 
this is so this is so nice actually i need to do this on camera so when you take it out literally the phone is like right there like that pull that up you got your charger so one USB C to lightning cable which is perfect because i think with this phone if i'm incorrect i'll have to i'll have to correct this in the comments in like the little description area below but i'm pretty sure with this phone you can actually use this charger on one of your like macbook pro USB C cables and it'll charge it like super fast without actually you know damaging the phone at all whatsoever look at that that is such we're just gonna that is sexy oh is there anything on the, on the back of this is this just the back or am i supposed to it's got to just be the back because it looks like the box that is this is this is so pretty it's basically like the shade of my denim i love it and i'm downgrading in size from the xs max to the um 13. the xs max to me was a very heavy phone i don't need a phone that's this big so i decided to go with just the 13 pro as opposed to the 13 pro max and i'm so glad that, that i did because this is like the perfect handheld size so we're gonna go ahead and turn it on oh that is so cute i love that Okay, Apple, take my money. You're always taking, take my money, take all my money. Take all my money, Apple. Quick start. Bring your current iPhone or iPad near this iPhone to sign in and set it up. I'm gonna pause this video and do that just because I don't want this to cut off and then I'll just like talk through what it was like. Back, I'm back. I attempted to go through the whole um, quick start setup process, but it was taking way too long and I wanna get this video done. And what I'm most excited about is the camera. So I just exited the um, setup and I re-erased the phone. And this time around, I'm not gonna do a data transfer. I'm just gonna have it set up as a new iPhone because I am going to switch them out so we can see the difference in camera because we all know that's why, that's why I'm here. That's why I'm here. I think that's why you're here too. But while it does that, I, um, I don't know how to feel about how far out these camera lenses are. Again, haven't had a new phone since the iPhone XS Max. So it has a very different camera situation. But just the couple of times that I've had to like put it down on a tabletop, I've been so gentle because they stick so far out that I'm like, what? I, I don't know. I'm about to be on Amazon like right after this finding covers for this I mean for the whole thing honestly but also especially for the cameras because that's gonna make me I'm gonna feel anxious so yeah the weight of this phone and the size of this phone is absolutely perfect I'm so glad I'm so happy about this upgrade I'm so happy I was like low-key tempted to do the Pro Max but at the end of the day I just hang on at the end of the day, I just didn't, like, I was actually getting, like, pain in my, like, wrist and weird stuff happening to my hand, like, dexterity things happening to my hand because how heavy this phone was. So I wasn't trying to do that again. Okay, agree. We're almost there, people. Almost there. Yay! We finally made it! <laughs> that took forever. Super clean and cute as usual. None of this doesn't have any of my apps or anything on here yet because I'm going to re like reset it up after this. I just want to do a quick point by point kind of comparison of the camera, the front 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 facing camera. So I'm using the front facing camera right now on my XS Max, and now we're going to see how the front facing camera on this looks. Okay, see, I didn't even know that they have different video settings. Okay, so this is the cinematic setting. So it kind of did like a depth of field in the back. It's a bit more like high contrast. It is, it looks so professional though. I felt like I just time traveled. Like in the beginning of the video, I was in like 2018 and now I'm in 2020. I, this, this cinematic one, listen, the cinematic one does, it does what it says it's supposed to do. 
This is cute. Okay, I'm going to try the like, I guess the standard video now. So this is standard. I think it's a bit like, I think the exposure is a bit more kind of true to life than on my phone. Like maybe it was just the way I was looking at it, but like it looked a, a little bit more like high exposure on the XS Max. And this looks like way more professional, way more kind of like true tone, like how I look as a person, as opposed to sort of like washed out. I'm like so juiced at this quality. This is so good. And I didn't, I didn't even think about the fact that the mics are probably different too. So let me know if you think there's a difference in how the microphone sound and how the audio has been coming through. That, the XS Max has seen better days. Okay, so be, be gentle with her. But just let me know what you hear. I am loving this. Loving it, loving it, loving it, loving it. I'm going to go and get my phone finally fully set up now and really play around with like the different kind of like cameras that are on the back. And also before I jump off, I just wanna say that I um, am really excited, especially for this phone so that I can bring more videos to y'all because your girl is living in London, okay? She finished her masters, okay? There's a lot to talk about. There's a lot to talk about and there's a lot to explore and do and we're just going to we're gonna go with the flow don't 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 hit subscribe if you want just one kind of content here it's not that kind of channel okay it's probably gonna be pretty random but such is life so i'll see you on the next one and let me know what your thoughts are down below in the comments thanks so much for coming along on this little ride with me bye